During your journey all around Hoenn, you'll find many different buildings that will affect your quest. When you advance in the game, take care to visit all the places and to speak to everybody, since you will obtain very useful information. One of the most important buildings that you will always find in all of the towns and cities are the Pokémon Centres, where you will be able to cure your Pokémon, not only if they lack energy, but also if they've fainted. In addition, you will recover power points for the attacks and you will always have a PC at your disposal to organise your Pokémon and your items. In the first floor of the Pokémon centres, you will be able to have access to the game's multiplayer options. Another place where somebody will take care of your Pokémon is the daycare centre, where you can leave two of your Pokémon and they will grow their level. If you leave two Pokémon of compatible races, it's possible that when you return they will have made an egg. Throughout Hoenn, you will find many stores where you will be able to buy items like potions, antidotes or Pokéballs. Most of the stores have a selection of varied objects and in the big cities you will find big malls of several floors where you will be able to obtain everything that you can think of, like dolls and decorations for your home. If you don't want to have all your special items at home, when you obtain certain abilities, you can create a secret hideout in the most peculiar places. Another place that you need to visit during your adventure are the gymnasiums that you will find in several of the different cities that comprise Hoenn and where you will obtain gym badges that will demonstrate that you are the best Pokemon trainer in the world. The other great surprise of Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire are the Pokemon Contest Halls, a series of special events where your Pokemon will be able to demonstrate that they are the best. <laughs>